Oh yeah, and I've got a quick update on that book that I bought last time, the uh, Rust and uh, the Rust Games book from Prague Prague. Now this is not my first book uh, related to Rust, but I think uh, I think even if it were, it would be totally fine. It starts off very very simple, and I've already gone through. Like I, I bought this; uh, it's in pre-release. I've already gone through most of what's, I guess, about half of what's available so far, and uh, got a little Flappy Bird clone that I made with it that I'll demo here. So you can basically hit space and play, and if you get past any of these barriers, then you get a point. Uh, then. If you hit anything, you die, and it's it. Keeps track of your points just like Flappy Bird. Now, obviously, this isn't the uh, most impressive thing in the world, but what was kind of surprising to me is that setting this thing up, uh, or, or actually writing all of the code to do this, was only 200 lines. Uh, it's because the uh, the book doesn't have you go through the you know the lower level stuff you're basically using a library that the author made or at least the author started and a lot of people have been helping on called bracket lib and uh you know it deals with the low level stuff gives you some some helpers for quite a few things actually for not just graphics but also io and random number generators which i mean there are standard things already in rust but it's uh uh, it's just got a lot of little helpers, and I am looking forward to going through uh, the later parts of the book and get the uh, dungeon crawler thing built.